Hello everyone, hopefully you can all hear me. I am using my headset again. I'm giving it another go. So if the audio quality sucks or whatever, I do apologize. But I'm also using the PS5 controller as the um, microphone, not this now. Okay, so that's probably why. I want to go to a different world. Hmm, maybe not. I'm just going to stay here. So my goal is, for, for my account, my hardcore Iron Man, to get to level 40 fishing. <coughs> and then... I will go back to leveling up my character some more. And once I'm out of food, I will come back and fish until I have plenty of um, fish again for food. So in the meantime, while all of this is going on, let's browse Steam because just watching me fish, in my opinion, is kind of boring. So let's see if we can find something new to play for our YouTube. So that's the whole point of my channel, is to play new games, get out of <coughs> my rut of playing the same old games. like. Right now I'm playing an old game. I'm playing an older game because, well, I want to. I want to play an Iron Man character because I have never done it before. And honestly, I'm enjoying it. Not having to deal with money or worry about, oh, I need money for this or this or this or that. Honestly, it's the best thing ever. So let's just like, peruse some possible games to play, because why not? So this came out last month, okay. Open a world set in a golden age of Caribbean piracy, okay. Two hour long adventure, ooh boy. I mean, so far it looks like a beautiful world. I'm not lying to you guys right now. But does it have... ship combat? Oh, it might. Oh. I mean, that looks kind of dated, but... I mean, I don't care. So is this. It has ship combat. Oh, how similar is it to Assassin's Creed Black Flag? I have played that before, never beaten it. And no, I will not play it again. I will consider it. Is this a, um... Uh, I don't do roguelikes, I'll pass them. I'm not into roguelikes at all. I'm really not. Oh, procedural generation, okay. Free to play. How is it 2.5? I wouldn't consider this 2.5, but I don't know. I'll consider it as well. How many tunas do we have? Good lord. <laughs> Aerial combat, maybe. Oh, it's episodic? I'm not gonna pay 15 bucks per thing, I'm sorry. 
Uh, no, I'm good. Um, this one might not be okay with the YouTube. Let me just check the thingies here. Okay, so it is okay with YouTube, but I'd rather not whenever I can just watch the anime. Nice design for the maps. Okay. A 3D element to the maps, kind of. Nice. No, it's not. It's 2.5. Okay, never mind. Dungeon and Corrado are class based. I will consider it. Wizard Quest. <clears throat> you can play online for this. Okay. Cool. I mean, um, not that I would play online, but. <laughs> My kind of game right there. I'll consider it. Fantasy Commander. Ooh. Oh, you have me sold on tactical turn based games. Hmm. You have me sold on this already. Maybe. I will consider it. Dungeon Mage? Okay. I'm not fishing anymore, am I? I am not fishing anymore, no. I need to fish before I get kicked off the server. Because, um, yes. Now, is it a roguelike? Surprisingly, it's not. I will consider it. I say consider it, but I may not ever go to it until I find it again. Just, just a fair warning. I would add it to my wish list, but I already have 188 games in my wish list. So. Mm. This kind of reminds me of, um. Nah, never mind. Maybe not. Hearts for health? That's a pass. If I want health, I want numbers for health. Please and thank you. Uh, let's do... It's on sale for my list right now. I've been sitting on this for a while, the SRPG, because, I mean, it gets constant updates, more updates than what I'm using now for my game, and that, what I'm using now is RPG Maker. This SRPG, last I checked, is like two or three updates a month, so that's way more than RPG Maker MZ. Where it's like one update every like six months or every three months or or less so i've been sitting on this i want to make i want to make a game like that right there where it's a tactical turn base but i want to finish my project in rpg maker first before i do that one and that one actually has a demo you can use too which is what I would use first before I buy it to see if I like it or not. Or RPG Maker is like, oh, you want to use our, pro our, our program? Well, you got to buy it first before you can use it. Which is fine, but it's like, what if I don't want it? What if I don't find out I want it in the two hour time limit that Steam has? Then I'm just, then I'm stuck, you know? Turn-based tactics. Ooh, I'm sold already. Oh, ho, ho. So you can do stealth too. Oh, oh, ho, ho, ho. does it have controller support? It does. <laughs> That's an ad. <laughs> hey, 
I'd rather not be a stalker. Uh uh uh. And if I'm gonna play arcade games, I'll play actual arcade games versus fake ones. <clears throat> We're almost done, nice. We can go see Mr. Styles. When the devs could put a bank right here instead, but that's just me. That's just me. How's the combat in this? Hack and slash, hand drawn, okay. Mad scientist roommate. This is probably going to be a... Yeah, I'm not playing it because it has um, women in bikinis. I don't want to piss off YouTube. <laughs> Another one. I don't want to piss off anyone on YouTube because of certain genres in the game. No thanks. Female protagonist? That's fine. I don't mind that at all. What is that? HUD? Wow, that's cool. Psychological horror. Um, no thanks. I don't want nightmares. Psychological horror and puzzle. No thank you. Choose your own adventure, visual novel. Okay, I'm gonna find with that one. I mean, I do have plenty of visual novels for now, so I can always find it later. Horror games, I'm not into those. I, I rent an apartment, I don't wanna be screwing my head off and get evicted for, for, for that, so no, I'm, I'm, I'll pass. Procedural generation, oh. <laughs> Is it roguelike? Dungeon crawler, okay. Character customization, a big deal, who cares? Well, I mean, I don't mind that as long like, if it's where you gain, gain a level and you can put points into your character or if it's armor or weapons, like that's fine. But like, the character customization where you can design how your character looks, that anyone will never see your character at all. Who cares? Just stop doing that crap, please. No big deal. If I can never see my character's face or their clothes or whatever, what's the point? If I can only see my character whenever I'm in the menu, then the character customization is pointless. Like, that, that part of it is pointless to me. I could care less about it at that point. But the character custom position where, okay, armor changes how you look. Or weapons, or stat allocation, skill point allocation. That is fine. I am all for that. The rest of it, stop, please. Because you never see how your character looks. If they're encased in, a, in an armor suit, you never see their face. You never see their tattoos. You never see their scarring. You don't see any of that crap. There's no point behind it at all. And if that offends any of you, I don't care. I'm making a point. <laughs> Full inventory, time to go see our friend Styles. We're almost there. No, not target. I want level. I don't want to even have target. This is dumb. Oh. <laughs> I'm going set higher than what you currently are. How about no? We're halfway there. Okay, cool. I wonder. I can probably fight here, actually. Just cut a tree down. Cook my fish, and there, I mean, there you go. I mean, shoot, dude, why not? Let's do one more. Now, nah, I'll pass. <laughs> That's a big nope for me. 
cool art style though, but I don't wanna I don't wanna be a cow. I really don't. I don't wanna be a cow. No thanks. Ask ask when you um take life sims too far, in my opinion. Oh, it's a bullet hell. Hard pass. Ah. No map. I'll pass. Um, no. I don't like horrors. Or, or mailman sims. Early access? I'll wait for Oh, that's the back room. Never mind. I don't, I don't care about that one. Eh. RPG maker right here. How much is it? Ten bucks. I mean, that's not bad. Pants down for the best experience. <laughs> oh my lord. They even drew their own monsters. I like that. That's cool. This was made, I think, on VX Ace. I think, yeah, it was. This is VX Ace. Or VX. Well, using those graphics, that is, or similar graphics to that. But VX Ace cannot do side battles like this is using. So. They might have used some assets from VX Ace or something similar to that. I'm just guessing here. Cool design for the map. Holy crap, dude. Is this also RPG Maker? Point and click, text based. Huh. Oh, that's a world better, so that's probably a um D and D type style game. Oh, yeah, we're not playing that game. I don't have the um this one again. Okay then. Free to play puzzle exploration. Well, I mean that was fun. How a wonderful franchise just falls. They don't have the new one on here? Are you serious? What? what the heck is this game? What is this one? Infra. Oh, puzzles now. I'll pass. I will pass. I don't care about puzzle games. What do they have on sale? Oh, just Guilty Gear? Eh. 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 You're probably all telling me right now to play this. I have. I played it, well, I played the base version without the extra content on PS4. I'm waiting for all of to come out at one time on on um well I'm waiting for the already finished version of part three. Cause I guarantee it's already done. I guarantee it is. They're just milking it. For seventy bucks a pop. Which is why I don't condone Episodic nonsense. The 70 bucks a pop is just is stupid. 
and you're gonna have another interlude or intergrade between part two and three. So, I'll, I'm just waiting. <clears throat> Supposedly, part two comes with part one and part one and a half as well. So, I'm waiting to see if part three comes with all of it once. If it does, then I'll pay, pay 70 bucks for it and get my actual 70 hours worth of gameplay for my 70 bucks. But right now, it's not worth paying 70 bucks for 20 hours of content. It's not worth it. Because this is only 20 hours of gameplay. So technically, in my opinion, it's 20 bucks. That's how I view games. If it's only 20, 20 hours of content, then it's only worth 20 bucks. You, you gotta get one, one for one when it comes to pricing on games. If you don't get that, it's not worth it. And there has to be a cap on the price too. No more than 60 bucks. Paying 70 bucks for video games nowadays is, it's stupid. And they claim that this is the true original version of Final Fantasy VII. Where's the, um, where's the original combat? This, if Ever Crisis is the original version of the old school PS1 game, Where's the old school combat? But now they had to make it a mobile game instead. <clears throat> Sims 3, pass. Skyrim VR, I don't have VR, never will. VR is in its infancy stage still. It's like a newborn baby. It's only like a month old, and it will never get past that point for at least 20 more years. We're almost there, we might level up. Then we can go kill stuff. I've considered playing this, but I don't know. Is this what I think it is? Yeah, we're not playing that. It might have um, adult content in it that's not safe for YouTube. I'd rather not. Um, I'm not gonna play Kimchi, I don't care for that game. It's okay to watch, but, eh, I don't wanna play it, I really don't. Actually, hold on, I would play it, if, and only if, nope, never mind. No controller support, boo! Must have my controller support. I know I know what up. If I want to finish this um inventory, and then I'll go and um cook it all, burn most of it because you know that's just how it is. And then we'll go kill some stuff. Probably in the next video actually. I gotta make sure that I'm actually getting audio and all that crap in this video. Because I don't know if I am or not. That's a cool flame trail. I'm not gonna pay money for it though, if that's how it is. <laughs> I ain't gonna give this game any money at all. There's no point.
This is a Halloween version of... I think it is. No, it's Escapes of New It's not. I was wrong. It's whenever they first introduced um, summoning. Inventory is full. Food. A <clears throat> hundred XP per cook, holy cow. Yeah, I'm gonna burn most of it too. <laughs> I guarantee I'm gonna burn like over half of this fish. I leveled up, holy crap. Can make a pad of butter? What? There's a game that I really want to play. Comes out in a couple of days. Oh, well, yeah. So I burned 10 out of so. That's not bad, I guess. I mean. So, I want to see if they maybe. Early release? I mean, I doubt it. It just never happened before, but. We prove it did, honestly. Nope, okay. And it still shows for that date. That's good. It does not have this in it. I'm sorry. It does not have that in it. You need to remove that tag. Now, I legit own the first one on Super Nintendo. And I watched some gameplay for 2 and um, 3,000. And I will not play those games because the graphics are worse and so are the um, crash mechanics. I don't care for how the cars um, tumble in a weird way whenever you crash. And you keep going as well. Like, no. Like, I don't like that at all. Like, th th like this, watch the video. Like, that's the one I own right there. That looks like crap. That's just a reskin. And that's, you know, eh. Like, Graphically, the first one looks better to me. It has better music as well. And, and, like, I want the devs who are doing this to put Top Gear 2. Well, it's, it's actually called Top Gear in America. But I want them to put Top Racer 2 and 3 in the first game. And then, sell the, and then sell that one as a standalone for 30, 40 bucks. I would buy that. I would buy that hands down. And yeah, I, I would buy it.
All right, so we're gonna cook some more fish. We're pretty much gonna cook all of it because I will need it because this only heals. Yeah, 50. And once I hit 30 constitution, which I know I won't before I'm done with this, but once I hit 30, it'll heal its maximum amount of like 75. That's not enough. I want lobsters. As I said before in my previous videos, when I'm playing this, I want to catch nothing but lobsters. They give the max amount XP versus tuna and swordfish. Swordfish is a, is a chance to catch. You have the lowest chance to catch swordfish while catching tuna as well. So there's no point even bothering with that. And here's an example. I caught 194 trout to 41 salmon. And that's the 41 salmon that I successfully cooked while doing all of this. <clears throat> I actually, I can use the salmon first, then the tuna. Was that's probably what I would do. That way it saves the better food for later and that way it is. Well that way it will be better whenever I actually need it. Because right now it does not heal its full potential yet. It heals 25 less. So, using the salmon for right now, when it heals what tuna heals, is fine. <clears throat> Once I'm done cooking up, I actually might just go ahead and stop cooking after this batch here because I don't really need food since tuna also heals for now what salmon heals and then I will more than likely just go ahead and go back down into the um, dungeon where I was for the minotaurs and the wolves and just start, you know, going at it again. Yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and do that now. I'm gonna go down there. And then once I'm down there, I will put a cut in the video and then come right back with some more. Cause, yeah. Probably could fight them, but I really don't want to. Not until I am equal to their level or higher, so I don't have to right click anymore. I don't like right clicking to attack enemies. No, I will do that for the spiders, the ones that are underneath Lumbridge. I will do it for them now. And with the combat changes, they made it to where you never miss, which is is honestly a good thing. You you still miss, but whenever you do miss, you do damage based on your accuracy instead of no damage at all. Which honestly, 
is nice. I I'm okay with that. And now you also have a 10% critical chance as well. You get more if you're a member, but I'm not a member. And it goes up to 50% at level 90 strength. But honestly, I'm not gonna give money to this game. I don't care about that at all. I've given them money before. I'm not gonna do it again because membership costs like 20 bucks. It shouldn't cost that much at all. I'm sorry. It really shouldn't. But anyways, I'm going to go ahead and put a cut here. And I will see you guys in the next video. Have a wonderful day.